Wisconsin has now fully vaccinated 1 million people, but as more and more people begin the vaccination process, doctors are stressing the importance of finishing the two dose regimen for people receiving Pfizer or Moderna. Sharon Bagenda live with more on those concerns about second dose hesitancy right now. Sharon. Yeah, good evening. Various studies show one dose of the Pfizer vaccine could have anywhere between 50 to more than 80% efficacy, but doctors say a single dose is simply not enough. A one shot certainly seems like it does something. On Monday, the CDC released data after studying nearly 4,000 healthcare and frontline workers for more than three months. It said Pfizer or Moderna's vaccine had an 80% efficacy rating two weeks after the first dose. But doctors say there's not enough robust studies providing an exact amount of efficacy after just a single shot. What we want to avoid right now is uh, with incomplete data telling people that it's okay just to get one shot. Dr. Pothoff says the CDC still recommends both doses for highest efficacy of near 95%. Until we see trials that are designed specifically to look at single dose, uh, it's just hard to give that a green light. If you were to give me an option be between less than 90% to more than 90%, I will take more than 90% any day. While some people may experience worse side effects than others from the vaccine, Dr. Pothoff says symptoms from COVID-19 vaccinations are not life-threatening and most are easily managed by taking Tylenol or ibuprofen. It's so much better to experience those symptoms uh, and then build immunity to COVID-19. COVID is like playing the Russian roulette, right? It can make you really sick and it can kill you. Well, Dr. Pothoff says it's hard to know whether a future COVID-19 booster vaccine would require one or two shots, but typically boosters are a single dose. Reporting live in Milwaukee, Sharon Bagenda, CBS 58 News.